Well, hello there, ladies and gents. I'm Tammy Sipniewski, your crypto queen. Thank you so much for popping by on my channel. Not financial advice. This is strictly for entertainment purposes only, but to remind you to only buy on that red candle. All right, ladies and gents, who wants to talk about some sexy anime pinup girls? That's right, we're talking about Catgirl. Look at all of these lovely zeros on BitMart. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight zeros on the BitMart price. Plenty of room to grow with this coin. I love this coin. This coin already has such a huge following. So many holders and so many people who this is on their watch list. This was one of my lottery ticket buys. So I just thought it would be fun to own it. And I only put like 20 bucks into it. Let's do a little bit of a deeper dive to see if I'm going to add to my position. So checking out their website, they do have white papers. And it says that it did pass an audit through Solidity Finance. So on their website, it says they have over 200,000 holders. So they started out with 100 quadrillion tokens, but 63% have already been burned. Like that's a lot of burning in this amount of time because I think they launched this coin in September. So it's only three months old and they've already burned half the tokens. Let's check out the tokenomics. And of course, to be involved in any of this tokenomics, you won't be able to have your token sitting on BitMart like me. You have to put it in their wallet here. So you get 1% reflections. You will receive an instant 1% share, meaning you earn by just having Catgirl in your virtual wallet. 1% auto liquidity. Every trade made through Catgirl will contribute 1% towards automatically generating liquidity. 2% will be contributed to our farming pool. This farming pool will be used by our NFT NFTs to earn you profits. And 1% of everything goes to marketing and the development budget. So looking at their roadmap, they have like more than half the stuff all done and checked off. They have the website launched. They're listed on CoinGecko. They've had events. They've got the cat girl swap. They're having a bunch of marketing campaigns. They have their own DAP. They're doing NFTs. I mean, so what's, what's left to do here. They are going to make their own play to earn game. That's great. I think anything that's gaming related, especially play to earn gaming, I think is going to be really big. They're going to do a whole Kakarol social thing, Kakarol workshops, NFT marketplace, which I think is going to be really big. NFT farming along to go with that and a merch store. Why do I think all of that is big? Because men like sexy women that are anime, of course. Yes! Yes! And the mascot Mitzi, I mean, she's so cute. I mean, she's not really sexy though. She's more like, you know, like a little girl. And you can check out all the different NFTs. I mean, they're gorgeous. I don't know who the artist is, but they did a really great job. So for a lottery ticket buy, I mean, listen, it's okay. I'll have to see what the game looks like when it's launched. You know, once that all happens, I'll sit down and make a decision as to whether or not I'm going to add to my position in Catgirl. But for right now, the little position that I do have, it's just fun to say that, you know, I'm a holder in it. So I want you to think of it this way. There are so many zeros in the price of Catgirl, a lot, a lot of zeros. For $1, you can get 230 million some odd tokens. Everyone can afford to at least be a Catgirl billionaire. $5 lottery ticket on Catgirl. Let's see where it goes. But remember, this is not financial advice. This is more of like a, a dice roll. And that's going to do it here for me today. I thank you so much for joining me. And until next time, only buy on that red candle.